Hello everyone, welcome back. This is Crazy Bat Lady. So today I wanted to go over the new weekly boss, Raiden Shogun, and give you some tips and tricks on how to beat her if you're struggling or would just like to know how to beat her quicker. Starting off with the team composition, you're going to want to have a shielder because her attacks are very sporadic and sometimes quite hard to dodge. So Zhang Li or Diona are going to be really good picks here. Also an Electro character. An Electro character is absolutely required. I'll go more on that later. And also some pretty strong DPS because she's got a lot of health. She actually has more health than Ishtaha. So keep that in mind when fighting her. Her first form is pretty straightforward. It's the same form that you fight in the first Archon quest with her, minus the ability to take away your elemental skill and elemental burst. So you want to do as much damage as possible. And when she goes into this state with the clones, take a look at the blades. If you see a single blade, that's a clone, and the cross blades are the real Raiden. And you get an achievement for hitting the real one the first time. She'll get stunned and you can do damage to her. Again, this is why I mentioned doing a lot of damage to her because her second phase she's a lot harder to deal with. Okay. Now she'll enter the state and get a pretty powerful electro shield. But um, another thing she can do in her first phase is release these Electro Orbs. When she does that, just hit them. They're pretty easy to destroy. Uh, when she releases three, just run up to one of them, destroy it, and then just kind of stand there for a second while the others explode. And she releases this one attack that instantly destroys shields. And it does a lot of damage if you don't have shields. Let's keep that in mind. I wouldn't too worry too much about the element that you're using here. As you can see, most of my damage has gone through the shield. She'll unleash this orb that will instantly kill any character if you don't destroy it. So this is why Electro is so important. As you can see, I casted Oz, it went away, and now I have a big shield, and I survived the slash. And shields will not save you from that slash, it's just an insta-die move. After you survive that, um, or whatever else she has done, just keep attacking her, repeating the process. Um, she'll also do this move where she puts down pillars and it'll push you back. Having a ranged character can help a lot right here because you can still hit her while you're getting pushed back. Once your shields are down, you can go ham attacking her and she'll be more susceptible to damage. So I hope Thank you so much for watching, and I hope that you found this guide helpful. Please, if you'd like and subscribe, so I'd appreciate it a ton, and have a wonderful day.